Hello everyone, today we will learn about how we can import data into our different entity in D365 or Dynamics here. So as you can see here on the left hand side map, we are having a different entity name as account entity, contact entity and one more custom entity called a name as product details. So when I click on account entity, you will see the record of account and we have some of the fields on account entity name as account name, main form, address entity primary contact and so on so to import external excel file data into the particular entity i have created a custom entity called name as product details so when i click on product details entity you will see the records of a product details entity and to import external excel file data we have to create a template for the product details entity so let us learn how we can create a template for this particular entity or product details entity. Click on setting, go to advanced setting. Inside advanced setting, click in on this drop down button. Inside here, you have to select data management. You have to mainly focus on two things inside data management. Template for data import. Second one is import. Click on template for data import when you click here a small window will pop up and a drop down button will also shown here right now we are working for product details entity and uh, we have to select the template for product details entity for this we have to searching for product details Yes, I have select the product details template. Click on download. You will see a template download in the format of Excel. Try to open this. Click on enable editing. In this template, you can see different columns are available related to the particular entity. Or we can say right now we are working for product details entity. It means these columns are related to the product details entity and the particular column describe the type of fields. Like when I click on name, it will show you a text kind of field. And when I click on owner, it is a kind of lookup. So in the real time scenario, when we are working in an organization and we are trying to import a record that time we are trying to import a record in the format of thousand to and to lack of records but in the demo purpose i am trying to add some manually data here and i will show you how we can import data using excel yes i have added some manually data here click on file Click on save, close this and uh, right now we are inside the data management, go to imports and inside import you have to click on import data, a small window will open here and uh, you have to select choose file from here. Right now we are working on product details entity, click the file, click on open click on next and it will you ask about two things allow duplicate and second one is select owner for the imported records so for allow duplicate you have to click no and right now i am the owner of this record click on submit button your data has been um, submitted for import click on finish as you can see here this is the file we are trying to import and inside status region you will see your status of your file mainly we are going through the three type of status region first is submitted second is parsing and third is transforming after this the status will change into the completed let me refresh this right now it is parsing and if we try to open this file you can see it will show you some kind of failure, success and fail, uh, partial failure status of your file. Now the status will change to transforming. 
usually it will take two to three minutes to import your data successfully once again i refresh this page right now it will show you status region completed success 2 and uh, error is 0 in total process 2 because we are trying to add two record for our product details entity let me refresh my page to check our data is imported successfully or not so you can see here our data is imported successfully thank you